guys, this is Calvin. Just uh, this is uh, the next project that we're working on. Um, we're doing a carport sort of extension for the shop here. So every one of these posts, we gotta dig a hole uh, for. We're gonna be sinking some pressure treated lumber in that. Um, so let's see. There's seven holes that we gotta dig. I'm gonna use the excavator, the 12 inch bucket. Um, well, we're gonna have an overhang here on the back side of the shop as well. So, um, we'll see how it goes. I'll uh, probably make a video, maybe be a few videos of this, but um, it sure will be interesting. First thing I'm gonna do is see if I can get the excavator in here, because I wanna start digging the holes on the back side first <clears throat> and this is the first post right here X marks this part spot so we'll see if all this garbage has to get out of the way hopefully not Seven holes about three feet deep <clears throat> uh, 12 inches wide about if there wasn't any rocks but that's not really a problem if it's a little wider because we're gonna compact um, some gravel around that uh, to hold the post in um, yeah it only took about oh, I'd say 45 minutes or so um, yeah the only little questionable spot it's not that questionable but we want to be careful about this hole here because we have a septic right here or drain field uh, kind of uh, so we didn't want to hurt any pipes so this one's only uh, two and a half feet deep or so um, but other than that this is really hard clay and um, yeah, you can see really stuck in that bucket and that's why I want to get a, a 24 inch bucket is because uh, the, the dirt gets stuck in a 12 inch bucket and it's hard to hard to clean it out so you can get another scoop so anyways that's what we got done and then uh, the next video we're gonna be hopefully connecting it to the shop sort of like that over there but uh, yeah a little bit of, uh, more posts so Anyways, I hope you like this video, and uh, I will uh, see you guys in the next one.